Hey there guys, welcome to my channel. It's Amanda. Thank you for coming by today. Today's video is a cookbook collab and it is hosted by Southern Wife Everyday Life. So make sure you go over to her channel and check out her videos. She's got some really yummy recipes and make sure you also check out the playlist that's listed below for you and check out all the other creators making content for this collab. So I decided to use the Southern Living Ultimate Quick and Easy Cookbook and I chose this chocolate cookie pudding as my recipe for today. Um, I actually did the alternate recipe, which is a chocolate peanut butter cookie pudding. It's funny because I was originally going to make the original version of this recipe, but then my husband saw peanut butter and we had to make this one. You're going to want to start off by making your pudding. I had a 3.9 ounce package. The recipe called for a 3 or a 5.9 ounce package and as long as your recipe calls for two cups of milk for your pudding, it should be fine. And then you're going to want to mix those together and whisk it until it's thickened. And I had to mix it for two minutes. And then you put either a lid or some plastic wrap over it and put it in the fridge for five minutes to cool. And while your pudding is setting in the fridge, you're going to take your cool whip and make sure that it's thawed and put it in a bowl and then add your peanut butter to it and mix it around until it's smooth. Then you're going to want to get a bowl that will fit minimum of eight and a half cups in it. Then you'll take half of your Oreo crumbles and half of your whipped topping and peanut butter mixture and layer those and then on top of the whipped topping mixture you will want to put some peanuts and then you'll top that with all of your pudding mixture and then top that with your the rest of your whipped topping mixture and on top of that you will make sure that you put the rest of your peanuts and your oreo crumbles and then you will cover and you will put it in the fridge to chill and by the way, I did not use all the peanuts and all the Oreo crumbles. It was a lot of it, and I left over probably about a third left just so we could put it on top of our bowls when we served it if we wanted extra. I would like to take a moment and say thank you if you've made it this far in the video and just for watching and taking the time out of your day it really means a lot and if you're coming over from the collab I appreciate you being here and welcome I'm Amanda I'm always making easy recipes and trying to spread a lot of meal inspiration so if that interests you don't forget to subscribe I'd love it if you join my little YouTube family And here it is guys, the finished product after it's been sitting in the fridge chilling for a while. We really enjoyed this. Um, we were sitting there eating it and trying to figure out all these different ways that you could make this. Like different cookies, different toppings, different uh, nuts, all these different ways. And the possibilities are really endless. So I hope you guys will give this a try. It's easy and quick. And I thank you for watching my video today and coming by my channel. I truly appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you all have a wonderfully awesome, amazing day.